This is Perla Shaheen for Cal TV News, and I'm here today with the new Chancellor of UC Berkeley, Carol Christ. It's great to finally meet you, Carol. It's wonderful to meet you, Perla. So I know that you have a long history with UC Berkeley. You started out as a professor, and then you were the Dean of the Colleges of Letters and Science, and then you were the Executive Vice Chancellor, and now you're the first woman Chancellor that Berkeley's ever had. I guess, why do you keep coming back? I deeply love Berkeley. It made me the person I am. It transformed my life. I came here as a naive 26-year-old, and Berkeley changed me. And I now at the time in my life where I feel that it's time to give back. Cal TV produced a video a few weeks back about your appointment as chancellor, and a lot of students were concerned about Chancellor Dirks and his priorities with regards to the student body. So what are your priorities as chancellor? One of my priorities is the undergraduate experience. The undergraduates here are the lifeblood of Cal. They're the reason we exist. There is a very significant deficit in student housing, as I think any student knows. So I want to make plans to double um, the uh, capacity of our student housing system. I plan to be a very present chancellor to the students. Uh, I'm going to have open hours in the library. I'm going to attend a lot of student events. You mentioned the deficit. Um, chancellor Dirks had created the Office of Strate Strategic Initiatives to deal with the $150 million deficit. How do you plan to deal with that deficit? Uh, we already have made huge progress in um, reducing the deficit. By uh, June of 2018, by, um, as a result of actions that we've already taken, the deficit will be $56 million rather than $150 million. In part, we've reached this by um, reductions in programs, but in large part, we're doing it by increasing revenues. And many have identified you as a champion of gender equality and diversity on campus. Why do you think that is? Well, in part, it's because I am a woman. Gender issues have been important to me throughout my career, as have diversity issues. I mm -hmm. believe that uh, Cal should be even more diverse than it is. We live in the most diverse state in the nation, yeah. and we should represent that diversity on campus. And how do you plan to deal with the reports of sexual assault on campus? We already have um, done a, a, over a year's work on this issue. Uh, by um, uh, giving more resources both to Path to Care and to our Title IX Compliance Office. Um, we have been changing our procedures to make them more responsive. And I've appointed a special assistant to me, Sharon Inkelis, uh, for um, Title IX issues in the Office of the Chancellor, so they will immediately come to my attention. Thanks for watching part one of my interview with the new Chancellor. Make sure to tune in next week for part two.